It's been a day or so. Because I had to stop. Would you get in there? Open the door. I had to stop and, uh... Oh, come on. Get in the dead gum truck. Get in the truck. Throw that over there. Throw that over there. Get in the truck. We gotta get to the house. Get in the truck. Jeez. Actually, I'm gonna probably sleep here. Because it's getting late anyways. But I wanna have a beer first. And, uh... How about a pizza? You know, just to... Just to make sure we're okay. We might, we might try to head home. I think I know how to get there. But I need to find out. First, before anything... What? Oh, I clicked on the seat. Ah, well, that's okay. I guess we're sleeping here. It's early, early morning. And uh, we need to get to the house. These guys are still sitting here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get to the house. I'm going to put you through that stuff. And then when I get back, I will... Actually, the first thing I'm going to do, I'll find out where I can dump this sewage. And then, when I do, I will be back with you guys. So, after doing a little bit of, uh... Doing a little bit of work, I got an idea. You guy, you guy that cusses me all the time, you're about to have a bad day, brother. You ever seen, um... Whoops, you ever seen... Uh, what is it? Back to the Future? Anybody ever seen that? Where, uh... Where they run into the back of the dump truck and the dump truck just kind of dumps all the poop on them. Something similar is about to happen to these guys, but not quite in the way you would think. Let's get her started up here. We ain't going to need that seatbelt for what we're about to do. Oh, mercy brake, of course. Nope, it's down now. Something is holding us here. All right, like I said, you're about to have a bad day, my friend. Oops, sorry, didn't mean to. Let's put this back in neutral and jump out real quick. Get out of the car. Hey, buddy. How's it going? You don't have better things to do but smell bad? Yeah. What's the matter? You got you getting poop? Look at that. Uh. <laughs> Look, it's getting his car all nasty. It's actually sticking to his car. That's awesome. Sorry there, my friend. But uh, you just got. What we can? What can we call this? We gotta call this some kind of something, something. I don't know. Either way, you know what? You know what, buddy? Hey. Secret. Tell you secret. Oh, good God! Oh, oh God! Get out of the way! Oh God! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! I'm stuck. I can't move. Oh God! Close the valve. Close the valve. <laughs> Let's get the crap out of here. Holy crap! That was so freaking close, oh my gosh. He's gonna try to run over me, look at him. We're leaving. We are leaving. Let's get in the car, let's go. It's time to go anyway. Yeah, keep on hitting the car there, a-hole. All right, let's get to the house. Turn headlights on. We can't see nothing. Do we have not? Do we? Oh, we got headlights Hold on. Where are they at? No. There we go. Oh man. Okay, guys. I'm gonna be meeting you guys back at the house probably. Hopefully, I don't run into any any trouble along the way. At least we got rid of all the sewage. At least I think we got rid of all the sewage. Still feels kind of weird though. Feels like it's got a flat tire. Eh, we'll check it when we get home, no big deal. Who's this guy? You want, oh, it's a cop. What do we do? Is he just clocking traffic? 
I guess he's just clock. Oh, he's got a. They got a drug shake down here. Well, that's interesting. Early in the morning too. So I guess we're going to stop down here and and uh, see what's going on. This is the first. Hey, buddy. Am I, am I supposed to get out and talk to you, or I'm not sure. I'm drifting to the side here, man. I guess he's gonna let us go. God, there's a truck coming. He ain't stopping neither. What? Oh, come on, I've stopped. I don't get it. Why'd he pull me over? I stopped. Am I supposed to go talk to him, or? I guess so. Well, let's put it in neutral, and is he coming around that side? No. We got a car full of beer and pizza. All right, well, we ain't wearing our seatbelt. That's one thing we're not doing right. God, this is not good. Oh, jeez. Dude, go catch this. Look, here comes another one. Come on, dude, go catch these guys. Oh, I got a ticket for what? Eight thousand marks. What the heck is this for? It doesn't even say. Holy cow. Uh I'm gonna have to copy and paste that just so I can find out. Oh my fine is twenty one Oh that's my net in net income. My fine's twenty one fifty seven, but I don't understand what the actual ticket's for. Huh. Whatever this is right here. Uh, maybe I'm driving while impaired or something, I don't know. Let's just go ahead and pay it. Bye, losers. You know what? We need to give more. Yeah, take that. Let's get out of here. Can I stand on this car? Probably not the smartest idea in the world. You guys suck. Did you find me for dumping sewage somewhere? That might have been what it was. I'm not, I'm not still dumping it, am I? No, it's, it's all gone. I don't know what the heck they find me for, but we're going home nonetheless. A little less money in our pockets. Oh god, why are you rolling backwards, truck? The emergency brakes on. Huh. What is wrong with this game? What's going on? Jeez. Why they have freaking emergency brakes on and it's rolling backwards. What and it won't let me in. I don't get it. Let me in my dang truck. Come on, let me in the truck. I know I had the brake on. I know I did. So we got problems at, at home a little bit, not too much, but a little bit. We um, you get in there. Jeez, there's a windshield laying over there. I don't think we need to even pick that up, to be honest. I don't know what happened. Uh, so I was saying we've got um, the work we done to the car yesterday. We've got to finish that first. We don't want to leave our macaroni out here. We got to finish that first. And there's some bolts I missed, so I've got to go back and tighten those bolts up because chances are if I don't... Did that just go straight through the other side of the car? No. Okay, good. If I don't, I'll forget about it. And then, uh, it'll be bad news bears for everybody, so... It jumped out of freaking... Why does it keep jumping out of, uh... Why does it keep jumping out of gear like that? All right, I'll see you guys at the house. Unless something crazy happens along the way, then I'll see you back here. God, we're all over the place. I think something's wrong with the truck. I'm gonna have to fix it when I get home, or at least try to. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, my goodness. Well, that just happened. Oh, jeez. Police car flipped over there. Wow, this has been an interesting ride. 
We've uh, we've been lucky on several occasions here. We just need to get back to the house before we get hit or something worse happens. Let's see what we come up here. I'm not really sure exactly how to get back from here, but we'll figure it out. We could probably go let's see. Let me go this way. Pretty sure we're going the right way, I think. I'm also pretty sure we need to slow it down before we wreck. Maybe we can cut the lights off now. Should be a road up here on the on the right. It is awesome. Yep, that's the, that's the way home right there. All right, we're home finally. So what we're going to do is first thing, we're going to run in the house and put the food up. Let's go ahead and get the car cut off here, get it in neutral. Jeez, look at this mess. Did the bag pop open in here? It looks like it might have. Which is not good. Well, I guess we'll be taking everything in uh, one step at a time. Which I won't put you all through that. It'll stay in the truck. So, do we have power again? Because I believe I did pay the power bill. Yeah, and it's spinning up like crazy. My uh, phone is unplugged, which is fine. Alright, let's go ahead and get in here and get us something to drink. Get us a shower. Get us some mosquito spray ready pretty thirsty so that's the first thing a little hungry so I'll go ahead and get rid of that I'll leave the water running because it's probably gonna need more water after we eat spray some mosquito spray on us get rid of those pesky mosquitoes whoops didn't mean to drop that on the floor there I don't want to make a mess uh, that's the pantry And let's take a shower. MP. All at the same time. We're a little stressed out, but not too bad. Ah. Okay. All right, let's go uh, start working on the car. There's supposed to be a strawberry patch around here somewhere. I gotta find that. That's something I'd really like to do. I always got the wrong door and end up running around the house. All right, a couple things we need to do here. First things first. I wanna put the dash in. Actually, before we do that, we've got two bolts there we've gotta tighten up. So let's go ahead and get those bolts tightened up. We gotta put in, where's my toolbox? There it is. Let's go ahead and put in these two bolts. Uh, if I can get the box open. Oh, it was the right way. Put it up here where it's a little easier to get to. There we go. Alright, get into tool mode here and we'll find what wrench it takes to get in these. I'm not really not sure which one it is can't remember but they're right here don't go on it okay it's not that one this is why we need the thing down here uh, 
Uh, smaller. There we go. So we gotta tighten these bolts up because this is what connects those things to the pedals. If we don't tighten those, then we're screwed. All right. So we'll press brakes, and literally nothing will happen. Um, that we've got a few more down here. We've got to tighten up, I think, if I remember right. And yeah, I cheated a little bit and kind of watched uh, somebody put one together. So, because I wanted to make, I didn't want to put the thing together and then screw up everything, you know. These might actually be a different size. Uh, I think there's supposed to be some over here. Actually, I might have got most of these tightened already. Looks like I got most of them tightened already. Those need tightened. I think it's probably going to be a different size anyway. Well, it, it definitely will be a different size because if not, they would be showing up uh, green. Or if it was the size I had, they'd be showing up green, I should say. Okay, that's not it. Let's get the toolbox up here where we can actually see what we're doing. There we go. Perfect. That's not it. Maybe one of these small ones, probably. There we go. I think that might be it there. Oh, uh, where's that? There it is. Yep, that one wasn't tight. It's a good thing we checked that, huh? Still don't think I'm on the right one with the hose clamps. No, we're not. Let's go with that one. There we go. That one wasn't tight. Okay, those two are loose as well. I think those two will probably be this one here or the next one up. There we go. Tighten that up real quick. We don't want parts falling off going on rogues. We'd never be able to find them again, I don't think. Uh, let's see, what else? Um, hmm. Got some in here that connect the brake lines. I think, uh, can't remember exactly how the best way to get to it. Probably to lean into it like this so we can see it, maybe. That may actually be it. Or is it around front? I think that might be it right here, yeah. And that's not the right size anyway, so we'll go ahead and grab another one and see if uh, we can find the right size. Probably this one here. Probably. Maybe. If we're lucky. Okay, lean on in. Ah, there we go. Let's go ahead and tighten that up. And then other side as well. Very nice. And then we'll check the uh, the back back here. Because we've got brake lines that run to the back. They're going to be right up here. Somewhere. At least I thought they were. Hmm. I don't actually see those. I see the brake line, but I don't see... What was that? There's something. Oh, that's the, uh, there's something else we got to bolt up to. Is that it right there? Let's see if we can get up here and look and see if we can find it. Because it looks like it may be moved from the video that I watched because I don't see it anywhere. It was supposed to be, like, right in there. Like right here somewhere where the line came in. Oh, there it is. No, it's in the right place. It's just hidden. You can't really see it. There we go. Got that one in there. 
and then one on the other side. We have to get that one in real quick. Okay. And right there it is. Jeez, I can't get them. There we go. Very good. Okay, I think that's everything that I missed. Uh, I want to do a quick look and make sure there's nothing... Nothing, uh... Oh, there's one. See there? There should be one on every single line. That one don't have one. You'd think it would, though. Why doesn't it? But it don't. We have one here, here. Both of those are tight. There's one down there. There's one there. We got that one. Okay, that should be all of them. Alright, cool. Okay, so next thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and try to get the dash in. And, uh, we may actually have to pull the motor out again to get the, um, to get something else in, but I'm not 100% sure about that. And there it goes. We've got two nuts for this. There again, not really sure what size they're going to be, so we'll just have to do a trial and error type thing here. Let's go ahead and grab this toolbox and put it inside the car. Where we can actually see the work. Okay, so it's probably going to be bigger than this one. Bigger than that one. Not that one either. There we go. There's one here, and there's one hiding back here behind the glove box. There it is. And you'd never even think of one being right there, really. We'll go ahead and get that in there as well close that glove box back now I think we can put this party in which is what we were trying to do earlier and never could get it to stay in but I think we can now ah there we go now is there anything holding this on uh-huh two bolts right there good all right let's go ahead and get those in there those are gonna be a bit smaller it looks like See the mosquitoes back. Well, dang, where is the right to the use? There we go. And only two for the dash, I believe. We'll check the other side just to make sure, but yeah, I don't see any more. Unless they're underneath it. We will do a quick look underneath as well, just to make sure as well. As well as well. Uh, don't see anything under the dash. Okay, cool. So, now, since that's in there, let's go ahead and we got the emergency brake bolts in, bolted in. Uh, I think they are bolted in, right? I think they are. Yep, let's get the gear shifter bolted in. We need to get that linkage on there. So I think we bolt this up first. We may not. I'm not sure. We may get the linkage on, linkage on there first. Nope. There we go. Alright, let's climb in here and put that in there. Get it bolted down. Okay. Uh, what else we get? Jeez, calm down over there. We got. Uh, we don't have to worry about the seats just yet. Although we'll have to get them in a minute, or at least one of them. We go ahead and get this gear linkage, uh, take it under the car, so we can install it. Should go like this. Nope, actually, go this way. 
Some of these are a bit finicky. But not that one. That one just went right on there, didn't it? Uh, do we have bolts to hook that up? I imagine we probably do. You would think. Let's get our flashlight, because I can't see anything. And we need to get this drive gear. we got to put this thing on there, and I think... We may actually have to pull the engine to get this on there, so if we do... Nope, there we go. It's on. Did we not bolt that thing up last time? Is that why it fell off? Will it bolt up? I would imagine it would. Ah, oh, there it is. I see it now. That's why it fell off, because we didn't have it bolted, I bet. Didn't even see that. Okay, let's get this spanner kit over here. Go ahead and see if we can get that bolted real fast. Uh, if I can figure out what size it takes. We might actually have to do that. Nope, here it is right here. Oh good, we're, we're on the size already. Awesome. Is there any more that need to be bolted? That one looked like it was hanging out some. Hmm, I guess not. Oh, that one is. Which means there's probably another one down there somewhere. Yep, there's that one up top. Mm. Can't really tell. Oh no, we've already done those. So I think we're good here. Alright, we're good there. Okay, uh, we need to put in this thing, the fuel strainer, and that goes here somewhere, but I'm not 100% sure. It looks like it goes up against that firewall. But I'm not 100% sure exactly where we're at. Let's see, where is the fuel intake at? Looks to me like it's going to come kind of the way we're facing, sort of. Or maybe like this. Honestly, I don't know. I fell down. Okay, let me see if I can figure out how this goes on here. So, according to somebody else, it goes right down in here, and there it goes. And then, of course, we're going to have to tighten that up, probably on both sides. Let's see. Should be a thing right here. Uh, actually, I don't see a bolt there. There is one over there. So, we'll go ahead and check that out real quick and make sure... See if we can actually bolt that up. That's be the wrong wrench. So this might take just a second. To find this wrench real quick. Uh, we don't try that one. Number three. Four. There we go. Number four, which should actually be what? Number six, I think? No, no. S yeah, six or seven. Alright, that's on there. And we said there was nothing on this one we had to do, right? I don't think there is. Okay, what else do we have around here to put on? We got... Should have went and got some gas. We got tail lights, headlights, seats. Could put a seat in. Uh, 
And then we should... Wow, okay. Theoretically, just move the passenger side seat. Whoa, quit doing that car. Good grief, I see. So we can move it back over. Yeah, it's done fell in the hole. That's fine. Keep on going, car. Keep on going. Change sides. There we go. Well, we had it there for a minute. Where'd it go? There. And uh, again, where'd our tools go? There they are. Bolt these seats down. Release this seat. Once these uh, driver's side seats bolted down, we're going to see if we can crank it up. Because I don't think we really need anything else to start it. I don't want to drive it anywhere. We might drive it outside. But we're not going to go far with it. Not yet. It's just not quite done yet. Okay. Round to the other side. I may actually have to go buy more coolant to, or not coolant, but a brake fluid. I didn't think about that. Should have bought it while I was there at the uh, station. I got two bottles of it, but I don't think it's going to be enough. Might be a little trickier. Oh no, not too bad. Get these bolts down here, and then get one in the car and get that one in the car, and we'll see if she'll start. I would be really surprised if it started, honestly. Cause I've, first time I've ever, first time I've ever built a car from the ground up, and I really haven't looked at that much stuff, uh, that many people's YouTube's. I mean, I watched when it first came out. I watched it a little, but not to this point. I mean, I just kind of watched it for about a, well, just enough to know that it looked kind of interesting. But then I sort of got on this video. They explained how everything was set up in the car, and that kind of, I mean, obviously, obviously, if I knew knew that, then uh. I knew how to put some things on, but I'm trying not to look ahead too much. Let's see, we got... Where's our switch? Our ignition switch, there it is. I don't think we have any power. We do not have power. Alright, well, let's jump out. Figure out why we ain't got power. Do we have battery cables somewhere? We got an, I think we got a new battery. We can pop that new battery in here. Charge that battery sitting there. Let's look in the car if we got a new battery. Thought that I bought one, but... 
can't remember. Well, maybe I didn't. I know I did. I bought that and I bought a, um, I bought a fan belt too, but I don't see it. All I see is food. Oh, there's a fan belt right there in front of me. Still don't see that battery though. So we may have to let it charge up for a little bit. Could have sworn I bought a battery. Oh well, that's all right. What do we pick up here? What is this? This is a seat cover for a Sumi. So we got a Sumi. Oh, look at that! <laughs> Not sure what to think about that. A steering wheel cover, I thought. Dash cover, okay. There we go, nice. Look at that, epic. All right, so what to do, what to do, what to do. Got this battery charge so we can. Uh, Start the car. Let's try it. All right, start her up. Nothing. There's got to be battery cables somewhere or something. Because the engine should be running. I mean... Unless because that belt's not on, that's I guess that's possible. Well, we don't forget our cool steering wheel cover. I guess that's what that is. Well, guys, I'm going to cut it here and try to get this belt on. And, uh, I know this episode kind of jumped around a little bit. I'm getting super tired, so I'm going to cut it here because I can't concentrate. And, uh, I will see you guys in the next one. We did get a lot done, at least. And we've got the, uh, most of the motor put together other than a few little short little things. We've got a lot of the interior installed. We've got a little bit more of that to go. Um, so, you know, we're making progress. It's a little slow, but we're making it. So, uh, anyway, I will talk to you guys later. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and we'll see you. Bye-bye.